Matthew chapter number 20 verses number 17 through 19 and Jesus going up to Jerusalem took the twelve disciples apart in the way and said to them behold we go up to Jerusalem and the son of man shall be betrayed unto the chief priests and unto the scribes and they shall condemn him to death and shall deliver him to the Gentiles to mock and to scourge and to crucify him and the third day he shall rise again Christ once again is trying to insulate his disciples about what's going to happen I mean this is the whole kit and caboodle right here he's going to be betrayed first given over to the chief priests and the scribes they're going to have a kangaroo court and condemn him to death then they're going to deliver him up to the Gentiles and how he's going to be scourged and crucified and mocked but the third day he's going to get up and you can see this is not the only time he tried to insulate his disciples about what's going to happen Matthew 16 and 21 you can read that for from that time forth Jesus began to show unto the disciples how that he must go to Jerusalem and suffer many things of the elders and chief priests and scribes and be killed and raised again the third day then you can read Matthew 17 22 Matthew 17 23 and when we get to it even Matthew 26 and 2 you can see where he constantly trying to let them know what's up the road and that's the way the Spirit of God is he wants his people prepared he want us to be prepared so that we can fight a good fight of faith so that the adversary will not catch us with our guards down and so he told them all was going to happen and then he told them but on the third day I will rise again there's hope no matter what your situation is there's a third day if you can hang in there there's a reward and there's a blessing there's a rejuvenation dare to dream again God we bless you we give you glory we give you honor and we give you praise